here, new here, I'm Kanitia, and if you're already watching this channel, welcome back. Today we are going to watch third episode of second season of Anime Made in Abyss. So let's get to it, let's go. Alright. Yeah, and already when I clicked on this, we are starting from the opening. And already when I clicked on this episode, I saw that the name of it is like a village of hollows. So I guess it like answers my question of who these uh, people are here. So Nanachi shouldn't really change, she's already kind of hollow, right? And in the opening, we see this expedition again. Huh. It's kind of interchanging a bit right showing the parallel like it, it is super obvious <laughs> like they, they are just shown side by side um this golden city expedition and our group so and that symbol we saw the like person turned upside down it was present here so that is very curious I wonder how our time will go. This this was Prushka though, right? Oh, that's nice touch. And that obviously our mom. I'm still wondering if we are going to see her. The compass also here. What is this in the very end? Okay, yeah, village of the hollows. Let's see how it goes. kind of look cute <laughs> and you remember that uh, uh, well this whole Nanachi's backstory right so when you get just abruptly shoved to the very depths you can change your appearance pretty dramatically right so it's not a sudden thing to learn here right doesn't exist that's convenient I wonder if there's a reason everyone is watching everyone is curious obviously they probably don't get oh interesting don't get visitors very often mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's true. Like a sentient robot. Hmm. They're all following. <laughs> and they have this also similar squishy quality that poor Mitzi had. What is he doing to the whistle? Breaking it apart? Why? You can feel her feelings? Mm hmm common language. So he's like revealing its true form? I guess it's gonna take a while. Is this for food? Nice smelling. <laughs> Everyone likes her smell. Smell. Oh. 
Oh. I see. So that's just like a cyber transport made for walking. Ooh, okay, the village. So they're just chilling here. Looks nice. Ooh. Yeah, but maybe they are using exchange policy, not paying with money policy. Her mom's drawings. Well, I again that uh, the stick figure. What would they do with her skin of fat, though? <laughs> I guess uh, <laughs> everyone has their priorities. <laughs> That's interesting. So Nanachi's body is also like in line of what she deserved. Old ritual site. They don't have a concept of personal space. <laughs> Is 
It's murdering it. As soon as we set off with the cute animal, I knew it's going to die. Oh, it's okay. She fixed it so easily. Well, sounds like, I don't know, yells of some huge animals. What is this? All of a sudden, just like right here. Are the hollows just being melted from time to time or something? What the... What are these things? Now I feel bad for it. It's horrible that it hurt Menya so badly. At the same time, you have to understand, like, these creatures, they don't really... Like, we don't know their values, they don't know our values. Yeah, it doesn't look like he's controlling it, it's just happening by itself. Like, is there really need for it? Yeah, we didn't see the creature that was uh, following us, right?
she's starting to learn the language. <laughs> Go with us. <laughs> No, I think she was just uh, trying to show. Ah. Yeah, she was just paying attention, unlike me. <laughs> I'm glad Mania is alive, but I I'm still thinking about the reckoning or whatever it was, balancing. I feel bad for the pink thing. That was horrible. <laughs> What's that? A hotel? Hmm, she has a lot of coins. She doesn't know how much anything is like cost. So they do have money, by the way. I just like forgot to mention it. I thought it was just like exchange policy only. Oof, it looks like a flower. Uh, well. My stomach would just die after this food, probably. They are used to it. <laughs> Maybe insects are interested in it also. <laughs> That's all fair. Um, yeah, okay, I was... These two are actually fine. I feel... It's me after my favorite spicy ramen. <laughs> I love it, but then I feel horrible. <laughs> Okay. I'm curious. <laughs> That's what you worry about. Can you really see anything b b behind all these bodies? This finger that you have to go through to get to their village, 
Is this the reason why there's no this? What is this? No problem with ascending. Is this another like white vessel of some sorts? Or oh, wait, that's she looks pretty. That is the person we saw watching us. Wait, we are going back to the backstory. So they also met strange hollows here or some sorts. Suicide Squad is correct. I'm surprised they're still all intact. And they were met right when they left the eye. I mean, yeah, they, 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 it makes sense that this is very dangerous. I guess the deeper you go, the more dangerous it gets. It, it kind of makes sense, you know? <laughs> that was pretty interesting. So they also met here people with interesting language. And obviously there are still dangers down here. There are a lot of stuff of happening here. Princess of the Hollows must be also some person that became a hollow, but like in a cool way, <laughs> like Nanashi or something like that. And it could turn out to be someone we know from the flashback, uh, like Vueka or that girl that I don't think we had her name, uh, the girl from the tribe that came with us and seemed to like take a liking to Vueka. Uh, so I think the, it would make sense for someone from the expedition to be like re referenced here and after all we are not sure like hollows might live for much longer right uh, so um, this is very interesting how I wonder with the balancing was this really a natural occurrence that just happens or does someone send this uh, entity because it happened right after Rico kind of determined the value of mania she said like she has no value it's too high it's like and so everything was taken from that poor pink creature and like yeah I feel the same as Rico it would be better if especially in the, with the people that you don't know it's not like uh, these creatures uh, you it, kind of try to protect your precious belongings because you don't know what it's like children children are pretty scary they can do something like that as well and destroy something that has value so to say right so it's kind of on you to keep your precious belongings with you or your precious pets with you and try to protect them so i'm not really like mad at the pink thing that it happened it's just unfortunate uh, that it happened and obviously i feel bad for mania uh, but i don't think we should really put all the blame on this pink creature and i felt really bad for it when it was like crying and everything and then it was just murdered it seems and everyone ate it like right away okay what the heck um so that was a bit peculiar and then we see this uh, princess most likely the one that lured us here first time we saw her it was the same three eyes but the like body seemed black maybe it was just the shadow because now she seems completely white it seems like that was all her doing 
uh, lure luring us in and taking our vessel here maybe again for her it's just oh they're like leaf creatures here it will be safer for them in the village most likely right so i should just make them go there and lure them there somehow like there, there could be different many different motivations here and um also what's interesting it's someone that everyone in the village really respect but it's also was sitting on a person uh, creature me mechanism uh, that looked very similar to the creatures that met our golden city group expedition in the backstory so that is um peculiar i'm sure it will be addressed in the backstory and we will see how it all uh, came to be but also yeah there seems to be a protective barrier around the village and as i said it's probably protecting the village from this uh, field of the bees which is quite peculiar because they all are already hollows and we are not sure like was it because they spent time in the depths they were exposed uh, in the depths and they became like this so it's something that should happen with time with Rika as well if she stays here and if we assume that her mom was here and also stayed here for quite some time should she also have a new form right now will we even recognize her when we meet her uh, there are a lot of very interesting questions here but this will be it for today we'll see if we find some clues in the next episodes and uh, I have to say this is really exciting uh, we have three more episodes this month and i think this season actually doesn't have a lot of episodes and by the way things are going we might reach the ending of the whole anime by the end of the season i didn't like check or ask if it's like the final season or is there will going to be a continuation mm -hmm. uh, but somehow i have to say well it's only been maybe three episodes but um, I, I don't want uh, to kind of jump the gun, so to say, but I feel like I enjoy this season more than season one. I, I thought season one was really cool. I liked it a lot. It was really interesting. Um, but I don't know. I just feel like this is even more exciting. Uh, maybe because season one maybe starts a bit slower and there's more like first times. So you're just getting to know this world. But here you already have lots of action and we are in this place that we were striving to find uh, maybe that's why it feels more exciting for me but I'm just like really enjoying it uh, so uh, yeah that would be as I said yeah it for today so please share your thoughts in the comments down below without spoilers of course thank you for watching and see ya <music>